After the lengthy challenge of the last level, a police chip stood proud after swimming to the exit. Unaware that one of the gliders nearby had followed him through. Without warning, the glider knocked him unconscious. Several minutes later, which I won't wait in this narration, Chip woke up, stranded on an island. How did I get here? Maybe I should have taken the title of the last level a bit more seriously. Hello everyone, Strug that. Hilariously enough, I don't remember how to do this level. <laughs> We're gonna try to figure that out. Okay, so... The goal is to get over there, which you can't do without flippers. I know that's alright. But what you can do... Is bridge back to where you were. And by doing so, you can activate the true power of... The thing. To open the thing and get out. Now people actually wanted me to uh, do the bold route in action. Which I will try to remember. Just a sec. I don't remember what's the bull route of this anyways. Something along those lines. But I think it's 134. So I might have lost a move. Hold on. Never mind, I got the wrong block pushing technique, which I'm gonna correct right away. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this, and this, alright, we got it, we got it all, one, two, three, four, five, damn, missed. <laughs> oh, well, let's retry. So you want to see a ball in my career, I can't even get it, it's my root ball, I'm on the list since I got it once, but... Can't reproduce it for some reason on cam. Which is sad. <laughs> no, but I can't, I can't reproduce that. Sorry, guys! <laughs> oh, that's because of full sec. Hold on. I don't remember what's the button for full sec. Ah, miss one. There we go, I got full sec. Whew. I don't have a full sec patched for the CCLP3 chips thing that I'm using since it's a completely different thing with the buns, sounds changed. So I don't get the first second instantly. I know that sucked, but there we go, I got the ball time. You're happy now? <laughs> You know what, this is Riot Sign out. I need more episodes. See you soon. Hello everyone, Rugged. Um, just a kind of bonus there. 
<clears throat> I really wanted to show you guys what happens when you die. No, <laughs> what happens when you press the, the button, that mystery button we all know about, the red button. I'm assuming it clones Fireball up there. If so, that room is not gonna be doomed at all. So, how in the world would you not want to press it or avoid at all costs pressing it? Well, you'll have the answer today. Pretty much. <laughs> so let's go for it, as I'm having trouble redirecting a simple glider through a simple loop to go on a simple bomb. Except the bomb is kind of hard to defuse, so I'm guessing it's not that simple. Okay, so we got access to this. It's pretty great. But I do want the fire boots to give myself more freedom. Gonna live with freedom, man. Okay. Freedom! Why did I do that? I'm not sure. Alright. In fact, I do need that block over there. Duh. Alright, let's go fetch it. Can I still fetch it? Yes, I can. Whew, thankfully JB was flexible. Okay, let's get that bloody boot. It's not that bloody, but... It's orange, so we don't know. Maybe it's tainted with blood, but it's well hidden. What happens? Oh, that's what happens, guys. You die. So, uh, on this science run, to, uh, to test and science and approve things, at least it was said by the hint. This is Riot Sign Out, and... I felt kind of guilty for leaving you with a four-minute video. <laughs> See ya.